You will need to remove the engine covers, red and yellow arrows, the air intake ducts, green arrows, to perform this work. Please see our article and video on engine cover removal for additional assistance by following the link at the end of this video. Once the system has completely cooled, you can slowly open the coolant reservoir cap to release the pressure in the system. Use care and make sure the system is cold when doing this. Reach down behind the left cylinder head and disconnect the wiring for the crankshaft positioning sensor, red arrow. Next, reach down behind and disconnect the wiring for the coolant temperature sensor as indicated by the red arrow. Use a T30 torque on a quarter inch drive socket and reach down and remove the single torque screw, red arrow, holding the sensor plate and sensor in place. You can now reach down and pull the sensor straight out. Coolant will flow out, so be prepared to catch it and dispose of it correctly. If you are quick and prepared to install the new sensor right away, there will be a minimum coolant loss. If you are reinstalling the original sensor, always replace the O-ring as indicated by the red arrow. Installation is the reverse of removal. With the sensor installed and tightened down, do not forget to top up and bleed your coolant system. Thanks for watching. Click here to view the original article along with hundreds of other DIY content for your car.